The bottom line today is that the worst is still expected to come. Civil Defence held a briefing at about 8 o'clock this morning and that was the message they made quite clear. The remnants of Cyclone Pam, this decaying subtropical system, have still not made their full force felt in our district. We're getting hourly updates and should the need arise we'll come together sooner. We're prepared, we're ready for this. So, um, yeah, it's, uh, community reassurance is really, really important. So throughout the morning into the afternoon we can expect 120 to 130 kph winds, we can expect up to 200 millimetres more rain on top of what we've uh, had already, which I have to hasten to add has been pretty moderate, 30 to 70 mils across the city rain gauges, about 80 to 120 mils across the coastal rain gauges, which is not too bad given when this started uh, late yesterday. So. We're in a, a good situation at the moment. There's been uh, no property damage being reported. There's uh, some, been some evacuations from Anara Bay, but those were voluntary. There's been some further ones from Tokamara Bay. They were also voluntary. So yeah, no one's having to leave their houses. They're using their brains and pulling out of places that are low-lying coastal areas. That's their biggest issue at the moment, the wind and the swells. They're predicting six to eight, uh, meter swells, I hasten to say, swells, and that's not waves breaking on the beach. 30 foot waves, well the mind boggles, doesn't it? So as I say, keep those hatches battened down and uh, stay tuned to your radios, know what's going on around you, look after your neighbours and we'll get through.